Hey what's going on guys it's Rich and welcome to another nuclear with one of the DLC camos as you can see I'm using the zombies and I'm also using the red dot sight reticule that comes with the DLC which is called splatter so uh, this gameplay as you can see it's on raid I am playing with Ali or Ali A as I usually do because we like to bounce VSATs off each other and it just makes playing a hell of a lot easier when you've got one good teammate who can help you on the B flag or can help you get some more streaks as well so that's the reason I play uh, with Ali a lot because we both prefer 6v6 and uh, we both love to use non-lethal kill streaks, and it's just so much more fun playing with someone who plays a lot like yourself. So uh, this gameplay, as you can see, I'm using the M8A1, which is a four-round burst weapon, and uh, I, I don't know, like I, I love this weapon, and I love some of the assault rifles on this game, but it's only recently that I really gave them a chance. Like when the game first came out, I only used the SMGs because I'm uh, primarily I'm like a rush-heavy player, so I'll use like an SMG with lightweight and try and get up in their face and try and rank up as quickly as possible. And these sort of rifles didn't really suit my playstyle, but then I tried them out uh, a few weeks ago, and there are some really, really good assault rifles in this game, especially since they nerfed some of the more powerful submachine guns. These sort of rifles are, you know, starting to shine a little bit more in competitive as well. People are using fouls, people are using M8A1s and AN94s. There's a lot more weapon variety in competitive, and these sort of rifles seem to be a little bit more dominant at the moment. So. Uh, the reason I'm using uh, the attachments that I am, by the way, the red dot sight helps because the iron sights on this weapon aren't really amazing. Plus, I wanted to show off the uh, the splatter rescue uh, stock because you can zoom in and you can just hand out these for free, left, right, and center, and extending mags because I believe this thing only comes with seven bursts. I think it starts with 28 bullets, and you know I don't mean to brag, but you know 28 over four. I couldn't do that in my head. That's seven bursts. So. Uh, throwing that extending mags uh, attachment actually helps a lot when trying to take out more than one enemy. So uh, this is the part of the gameplay where I get a little bit reckless. You can see me capture the spawn flag and I have my streaks. I'm on like a maybe a 19 gun streak or something and I rush over to the B flag and I jump right on it. And I don't know why I do this, especially when we're winning by like, you know, 60, 70 points or something at the moment. And it was completely unnecessary. But I did get two capture kills and the capture and the assist. So I got something like 625 points just from that so it helps me get my VSAT and EMP streaks which make this a hell of a lot easier and if you don't use EMP by the way EMP is definitely one of my favorite kill streaks it's probably my second favorite score streak after the VSAT and the, re uh, the reason being is you can just hang out in someone's spawn and just start killing them and they won't have a clue and I nearly died there to my man Butler Kid 199 uh, he missed his Remington shot, which doesn't happen too often. Usually when you see someone with a shotgun and you're in a close range battle, they're just going to hand out a D to you and you won't even have to charge, you know, you won't even have to pay for it. That's how ridiculous the shotguns are in this game sometimes, especially the Remington and the KSG. So, uh, the M8A1, if you've never used this weapon, I highly suggest that you do. There you can see the Brutal Medal coming up. And so uh, this nuclear is actually pretty short. It's only like three and a half minutes long after I edit down the round. Uh, so that's really cool. So if you've never tried this weapon, be sure to try it. And, yeah, you know, I think that's coming up to the end of the video. So, just before I go, I want to let you guys know that I will be live streaming tonight. I was um, asked by a friend, uh, PwnStars.com, uh, because he's moving out, I believe. He needs some people to stream on his channel. So, he's given me a stream invite. You can do that on Twitch where you just enter, like, a stream key. And you can stream on someone's channel. So, I will be streaming on a different channel today. So, if you're looking out for my stream, I'll upload a video. But be sure to click the video and click the link in the bottom. Uh, just so you don't go on the wrong channel. Yeah, you can see I die and at this point I was like no I was like one off and then I respawn in and there's the nuclear So hopefully you guys enjoyed this 31 gun streak with the M8A1 leave a like rating if you did and I'll speak to you all a little bit later on with that live stream See you then bye